I've sunk an enemy destroyer. With a crew so brave and a heart so bold, the stories of Druid will forever be told. In the echoes of waves, the legend will rise. A destroyer at sea, under the endless skies. Druid, the silent predator of the sea, swift and lethal, as deadly as can be. Hey team, it's Ripper. How are you guys doing? Fantastic today. Got a fun video in the Druid again, man. This thing can hold the flanks like a champ. Before we begin, like, subscribe, button below. If you see value in the channel and uh, what we're doing here, uh, how to build tactics, learn something from it, and have a great time doing it. And uh, go ahead and smash those like buttons and uh, leave a comment. We'll be do better. And as always, thank you guys for making this community a better place. So let's get right to it. The Druid. Another video. Man, this thing is so powerful, especially holding off flanks. And uh, I didn't really mean to do anything much uh today or just playing around and man i just keep getting really good games with druid and it, it's just the abilities of what this thing can do to an entire flank notice what our enemy or i'm sorry our friendly team is doing they're all bundling up right here and only leaving one two guys to take charlie and we're all going to be bundled up right at this island and you know what we're going to take advantage of this because they're probably on uh, the enemy force is probably going to be just focused all on that side right there so we're going to go ahead and just take advantage of flanks. And that's what the Druid does very, very well. It loves to punish flanks. And and all it has is two guns. You notice uh, my ship is very, very simple. It doesn't focus on torpedoes or stealth or anything. It really is just raw gunpowder. And you're going to see us just plow into this team. And we're going to hold an, an entire flank at bay. It's pretty crazy and pretty wild. Uh, right now, the th biggest threat to us right now is a radar cruiser. I don't know where the other um, destroyers at, being very sneaky right there. I've already double-checked the map. It is probably a Shima. So we've got a Benham, a Shima, and see what other guy. Yeah, Shimakazes and Benham. So the biggest threat is the destroyers, but we can't see them right now. So the other next threat is a radar cruiser, which is that buffalo that's hiding right on the corner there. And the entire enemy team is literally just going to bundle up right there. And again, we're going to use this to our advantage. We're going to punish you know uh the the enemy team for actually just focusing on that one spot and not actually doing anything or capitalizing on it notice that their battleships are also kiting away running away in the back hiding behind highlands i'm telling you if you don't do anything with your ship you're not going to help out the team and this is a team sport right and the other one is look at our team my team is literally hiding all behind what is what is the patrick going to do right here i have no idea ruin really can shoot over island stalingrad good for radar that's all he can do Prussian at least is somewhat in a shooting range, but you know what? We're going to take advantage of this. We're going to do majority bulk of the damage, and if our team's not going to do it, we're going to go ahead and do it ourselves. So take, take a look at just plowing right through. Just look at all that damage we're just going to put into the Izuma right here, and he's just not going to be able to recover from this. And uh, pretty, pretty darn wild. Let's see if we can get this kill. Yeah, something so nice and soothing about that boom. He goes down, splash one battleship down, and now our next threat will be what? Let's see. It'll probably be the bull Buffalo. Yeah, let's see if we can eliminate this radar cruiser. Okay, let's see the Buffalo right here. Buffalo is backing up with the Patri. I'm not going to mess with the Patri too, too much because he's got a lot of... Oh, his guns are swinging. Okay, now this is another observation. When you see the guns start turning, that's when you start going, hey, let me go undetected here and reduce my and mitigate damage because now they're all focused on me. Look at all their guns are facing me now. And that's why the, the smoke comes in. I'm well with outside the Buffalo's radar range. Last time I checked, it was 10 kilometer American radar. So we're just going to hold just right outside of that and still be within gun range. And notice that the Patri and Buffalo are just in a pickle right now. They have no idea what to do. They're getting shot from the flank. Look at our battleships right here. Look at this bulk of the force. This, this is literally like a uh, midway American push right here. All of us bulked up together. And look at us by ourselves, literally just holding off the entire flank. Uh, at the bottom left hand corner so we're gonna see if we can hopefully get a better wait a second hold on I, I, rpf just switched and we got torpedoes that's when i was like wait a second something's wrong here my spidey senses ticked in i have rpf and i'm going holy crap and there's something to our right and thank goodness that we got a radar from the stalingrad thank you so much and now we're gonna go downtown 
to Pound Town on the Shima Kaze. You know, something special about Shima Kaze players, I don't know. They're very, very sneaky, and all they know how to do is torpedo runs. And thank goodness, at least this Shima Kaze player is actually using his guns. Unfortunately, guns do not overpower outmatch the druids, and boom, splash two. He goes down for the count, and boom, we save that smoke pop uh, smoke real quick go break that line of sight with enemy threat and then go undetected and now we're going to go ahead and now they have no destroyer support over here we can just run buck wild over here and having a good time at just punishing broadsides and let's get right to it so let's get in position right here let's see we're going to punish the buffalo first yes sir bob let's just get the buffalo out of the game wait hold on a second uh, my smoke is still on cooldown 31 i am not going to um abuse this so let's let's do this the right way let's be patient don't worry, he's not going anywhere. He's got 13k health. He's a slow guy. And once we get that smoke, okay, we're within 10 seconds of the smoke. Let's go ahead and open up on him. All right, so he's going for it now. Notice that green arc. That means he's got the throttle gnashed forward a little bit and going half speed now. So we're just going to keep that. Uh, the AP is going right into his midsection right there. And notice that 1100, 1100, 390, 390, just devastating after a while. And he cannot su sustain this much damage. And it is basically next stop ground floor to the sea floor with all your HP. Let's see right here. Oh, man, I am bad at aiming today. Let's see if I can get There we go. Now we're, now we're starting to cook. There we go. And smash. Splash three. And now it is just pound town to Patri. And this is just us. His guns are not facing on us. His secondaries are not within range. So guess what? Watch what the uh, 66,000 HP does right now. It's literally just going to be a tick bar going all the way down. All the way downtown, baby. And let's see. Look at that. Oh, man. This is the power of the improved AP shells. I did the uh, on the commander build improved AP shells that give you the extra buff uh, to the damage. And, man, we are just melting this guy. Yeah, we're getting that non-penetrations on the torpedo uh, section of his ship. Hopefully we get the fourth kill here. Come on, baby. Let's go. Look at that. 16,000. 14. Oh, my goodness. That was a nice hit right there. Can we get this kill? Come on, baby. Give me the kill. Oh, he's still killed from the other Patree. Way to go. How oh, you deserve it. Another Patree killing another Patree. Way to go, baby. There it is. And pretty much is just mopping up on aisle uh, 69 right now. Let's see. It's Yeah, we just speeded up real fast. Ooh, yep. And I don't think I'm going to kill this guy. He's uh, behind that island. I would have had it, though. Oh, well. We just mopped up the entire flank. These two guys are just running away, scaredy cats. Yep. And yep, dep, dep, dep. Everybody's dying. Man, everybody's dropping like fly. Okay, here we go. We got the radar is activated against Stalingrad. Coming in clutch with the radar. And here we go. Let's take a look on another Shimakaze player. And shells are in the air, and there is nothing you can do about it. And splash four. He goes down 129,000 HP, and everybody's dead. Can I get the Kraken? Let's see if I can rush this guy down. Will I he survive? Hold on to your HP so I can get there in time to shoot. Come on. Oh, no, I don't. Unfortunately, we do not get it. Almost cracking there, baby. Another cracking another day with the Druid. 129,000. Hope you guys liked the video. Like, subscribe, button below. Leave a comment in the bottom of the screen. And as always, thank you guys for watching and supporting. Make this a better place to learn tactics and have a blast doing it at the same time. As always, number one in the team. Hope you guys are doing well. Make sure you say hi when you see me out there. And be safe. And hope you guys have a great weekend. Cheers.